Now he is kind of retarded, but he's low key pretty broken. Hey everybody, sorry for the, you know, late video. This should have been a lot easier video to come out. It's my Grammy video. I got a little sick. I didn't want to, you know, record a video with a, you know, roughed up throat. So I waited a little bit, but now I'm all tip top. So it's time for me to make this video. Anyway, without further ado, let's get on to the Grammy scaling. Okay, so when talking about Grammy, it's actually really, really simple to scale Grammy. It's so simple, in fact, that some of his best feats actually come from, in the Bleachiverse, come from Grammy, like him creating the B or to destroy the Serate. Or one of the most profound debated upon topics is the fact it did Grammy actually create a galaxy pocket space or just a portal to outer space. Now, of course, most Bleach Down players will obviously say, oh, of course, he only opened up portal to space. When, uh, to be fair, he really, there's nothing really implied that he did. But also the fact that the light novels directly state that he not only instantaneously, mind you, instantaneously materialized the meteor, but also outer space. Meaning he did not open a portal, he materialized the outer space, meaning he created a pocket space, right? With that alone, we can obviously see that there's a few star star systems, even a kind of like two to three galaxies in there, which would bring this up to like a galaxy plus level feat. Like I said, pretty straightforward. A lot of novels just tell us he instantaneously materialized it. So with all the, oh, he created a portal, that's out of the way because it's literally stated, stab down playing. Now, of course, there's more to go off of this. The fact that even the original kanji of the Kampachi versus Grammy fight doesn't say he's about to throw him in outer space. It actually says that he was going to throw him into a universe. Now, that would also imply that he created a universe, which the light novels don't even, you know, discourage this. It doesn't say, oh, he created galaxies. No, it says he created outer space, which the universe is of outer space, meaning that it doesn't even contradict anything it could just be like different you know iterations right so with that line you can also even argue that he could be potentially universal that he created maybe a even universe with that line you can either say he's galaxy plus to even universal now before i scale him a little higher i do want to address some facts now people are going to say oh how would grammy even know what a galaxy or universe is and this is a pretty dumb argument is if you use this logic you have to apply this to things like even kaguya which how do you know what how does she know what a star is is that a real star do you see how dumb like it's like you can apply that to almost every fictional verse and at that point you start to downplay a lot of shit to the point where a potential star or like a let's say a like planet feet just from some pixel scales and maybe be a continental feet you know what i mean so it really gets kind of iffy if you do that so it's just kind of dumb if you do apply it here apply it to almost every other verse as well as um another thing is the author like taiti kubo likes for his fans to read between the lines he adds these little side painting these side like manga drawings on the side between chapters right he actually did drew that grammy prehensively from this fight actually did have some prehensive knowledge of what stars planets and even galaxies were we see he's even imagining and thinking about it beforehand so he actually does know what it is so yeah he does know what it is another th thing people are gonna say is oh he couldn't do this because the bleach verse doesn't scale that high they're only a couple planets which is i didn't really address this in my cosmology video by as well now if that was truly the case that means one it's there would be no stars or nothing in the bleach verse because if you know the garganta is the encompassing force that covers the entire bleach verse if it was truly just like the waco mundo the soul society and the world of living were just planets right that would mean when it's nighttime and you look out or hell even when it's in the morning because logically there wouldn't be a sun there there is only just darkness which is not the case we specifically see inside that inside like when tosin and his Shinigami friend is literally pointing out the countless stars in the sky even in the light novels it talks about how there are literal stars in the verse so we do know that they are not just planets because if that was the case then why isn't it just black everywhere why is there a star in the first place if the garganta was just encompassing three planets do you realize how dumb that gets i should have addressed this in my last video but i didn't really think about that anyway just want to address that point and like i said there's a potential way to get him higher now my last video in my bleach scaling video i was able to get ishin kurosaki ichio's dad to fifth dimensional high multiversal plus because he was actually able to hold back the don guy which is actually just stated to be a hyperspace both in the japanese kanji as well as in the well french con in the french translations a uh, hyperspace being a, a potential 
actual fifth dimensional construct, which for him, you know, hold it back for two months straight would actually make sure he scales to that because he was able to hold back, you know, a multiversal size realm, right? That kind of means you scale to it. And of course, Kisuke actually scales to him pretty confidently in the fake Katakura Town arc. The reason why that's important is because Kisuke and Asuken fought pretty relatively until he went Bankai. Now, the reason why that's really important is even Asuken thought that Gremi, the self-proclaimed strongest Quincy, actually was a very dangerous thing. He would not even want to face a, well, you know, he wouldn't even want to face a confrontation with him. And as I said, they fought pretty confident with each other, meaning that if he even saw as Gremi stronger than him, so strong, he was like, why would even you hot ever even let him out in the first place? That would actually imply that even Gremi is stronger and he would be actually fifth dimensional or, you know, high multiversal plus. So now in speed, it's actually really easy. You can, uh, you've seen my speed video. You can easily see how just even a soul society characters can get into ftl plus to massively faster than light but some even better feats is the fact that the vasa lorde ichigo is able to destroy all of hell again go watch my vasa lorde video i go in detail with the canon city of hell now and scaling it as well hell actually would logically be infinite off some statements but as well as the fact that it would need to hold an infinite amount of souls because there are an infinite amount of souls that exist in the bleach world and that would need to have some sort of infinity to contain the evil souls with that in logic that that means Ichigo being able to destroy hell would be a actually infinite speed and even just Bankai Ichigo could traverse hell in almost a minute give or take right so that would be infinite speed as well and we just have more stuff support us even um Grammy actually created a Soul King Ken accidentally by imagining him Hinagamuke, okay, which actually just by casually moving had was stated in the light novels to have close to instantaneous speed mind you he actually fought Kenpachi and mind you it's kind of convenient they both fought Kenpachi Kenpachi, so it's kind of shows how fighting Kenpachi would be this kind of stalemate saying, okay, they would be scaled to each other, plus he literally just created him, so he should somewhat scale to him, right? As I was saying, he also even was when he actually started to fight and move, it was actually stated that he moved so fast that time itself stopped, which is just pretty crazy, right? So that could be an inaccessible to a measurable speed feat. Hell, if you want to be funny, even Soul Society cares to be argued a measurable speed because the fact they can outrun the cleaner, which is stated to move so fast that when it actually bumps into you or hits into you, it actually throws you off the time access down to even centuries. It was explained with the um, Yuichi saying that why they somehow ended up a few days in the past when they arrived in the Soul Society, and then Ishin Kurosaki gives a full in death the fact that it just moves so fast that it actually hits you off the time axis which would mean it would also have a measurable speed as well and yeah it really gets you know kind of, then you start looking at other stuff so you you pretty confidently have grammy even at these infinite and accessible to even measurable speeds so it's it's pretty cool and that'd be all and um also yeah grammy has the visionary whatever he imagines comes to reality you know pretty pr pretty uh if you want to know his abilities pretty simple uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. You know, I really like this video. I've been doing a lot more Bleach content, like I said, trying to transition to more of a Bleach channel. And yeah, that'll be all. Don't forget to join the Discord link in the description below. And that'll be all. Mr. Crafty, out. <laughs>